Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back for a brand new video. So for today's video, we're going to do like a little come shop with me. I only really want to go to Primark, but a park in Selfridges car park, so we might have a little browse in Selfridges. I'm not buying anything. I am not buying anything from Selfridges today. That jumper was my purchase. I'm putting myself on a spending ban. I'm not allowed to spend any large amounts of money anymore. I really want to go and get some of the cute Valentine stuff from Primark. I've been on a hunt for cute Valentine stuff. I've been to TK Maxx, been to Home Sense. I really want to go to Home Bargains. Maybe we could do that today, actually. But I really want to go to Primark. I want the cute fluffy heart socks. They've got some oodies and stuff as well. Please ignore the broken nail. That's getting fixed tomorrow. Yeah, I just thought I'd bring you along. I haven't done a video like this in ages because, mainly because I get stage fright. Let me put this down because my arm hurts already. Unless I'm with someone, I'm really like awkward and funny about filming out in public, but we're going to try. I'm still trying to find a little lip oil to put on. Maybe this one. This one's from Clarins. Today, I'm hopefully going to be brave. This vlog might not be very long because I am awkward filming in public, but we're going to try. And I'm also going to the Primark in town because that is the biggest one. I always say it's the worst Primark, which it is, but I can't be bothered to drive to Mary Hill. And my, like, local Primark is always just a shambles. Like, it's even worse than the town one, so I'm not going to go there. So we're taking a trip into town, which... Again, on my own, I don't like going to town, but we're going to go. I'm going to bring my headphones, put my headphones on. Just get in the zone, go and see what we can find in Primark. I've got this headband in again. These are from Primark, by the way. I keep getting loads of questions on where they're from. They're from Primark, but ages ago. Um, but I'll have a look if they're in there today, and if they are, then you can go and grab some. I think I've got a black one and a clear one, but I don't know where the clear one is. But my outfit's black today, anyway. I'm just wearing this, like, gym set from Tyler. I think I need to put a hoodie on, though, which I don't really want to do, but it's raining. And obviously the walk from Selfridges to Primark. I do have to go outside and I don't look like a drama rat, so I think I'm going to put a hoodie on top of this outfit. Actually, I think I know what one I'm going to wear. I'm going to wear my new Sisters and Seekers hoodie because I haven't worn this yet. And it also goes with the all black vibe, so I'm going to quickly pop this on over the top. I don't want a coat because I get so hot walking around shopping. Should I take this jacket off? Maybe I should take this jacket off because you're going to be able to see it under the hoodie, aren't you? So maybe I'm not going to wear this matching set from Tyler today. Well, I've got on my Tyler flares, which we all know I love the Tyler flares so much. I'm just going to pop this on. Let me not expose myself one sec. I do have this really cute little bra on that it got me for Christmas from Lounge. But it's got like a cut out detail at the bottom so I don't really want to show you that. I'm probably going to be cold in just a hoodie but by the time I'm walking around the shops and stuff. We're going to go for this. Oh cute. Right I'm not going to ramble. I'm going to go and get in the car and go. Let's go and do some shopping. Run away and I'm in Oak's car. I was originally going to drive my car but then... Oak just reminded me that he's taking my car to the alloy place to get one of my alloys refurb. Like, it's not even that bad, but because it's not my new car, well, I'm saying it, I've had it a year now. I scraped the alloy, shed it here, in the Selfridges car park in Birmingham. You know, like where it goes down. I'm usually so good at going down it, but I was being an idiot and I was putting maps on at the same time as going down the thing and I scraped my alloy off the side of it. So one of my alloys is scrapped, so I'm going to get it repaired. Uh, refurb. So yeah, I've had to drive Oak's car today. I don't, I don't not like driving Oak's car, but I just way prefer my car because it's like bigger. I just feel more like comfy and secure in it. But it's fine. We're driving the Mercedes today. But the only thing is, he's had his alloys refurb. Remember in like one of my other vlogs where was it in a YouTube vlog? Was it TikTok? I can't remember. He had all them red alloys on, and that was because his were being refurbed. So they were like the spare one. They give him while his was being refurbed. What I was even saying. Anyway, he's had his alloys refurbed and now I'm absolutely petrified to scrape a single one of them. Because <laughs> I'm just a girl. The curbs just show up where they shouldn't be. Do you know what I mean? No, the traffic's not looking good going into town, so that's great. Right, we've made it to the car park, but it is going to have to be a case of putting my hood up because it's pissing down. Headphones are going on. Slay. Hood is going up. Oh. Is my hood going to fit over the headphones? Oh, there we go. Right, this is the look. We're ready to go. Oh, this weather, it's so windy. I've been up on this scary bridge as well. Not fun. Right, so as soon as I come into Primark, it's all kind of like gym wear -y stuff. I found these little tops, which are really nice for Primark, and they've got like built-in pad in there. It's a collab with whoever that is and it's just got this little detail on the bottom but actually that's really nice and there is matching joggers as well but i have spotted these and i do actually really like these they're just quite wide so i don't know if they're going to suit me but i might just pick them up anyway and i'm guessing these are like the viral gym sets that have been going around on tiktok i'm not sure but i'm not a gym girl so i'm not going to wear those love this though imagine that like on holiday or like in the summer with like a big white shirt over the top and again it's got like the built-in 
padding. That really crop jumper would be cute over the unitard as well. And then they've got like a mint green version as well, which is cute. I need to Google this person because I have no idea who they are. And apparently she's a Spanish model and actress, but I can't say I've seen her before, but that's who this person is. There's a little jewelry stand here and these earrings are so nice. They're again from that lady's collection. They're £2.50. These ones are sick as well. And they've also got them in silver. They've got that little padded top in white as well. I think I prefer the white one. Like just a basic to go with everything. And then there is this like sort of like cargo blazer but it is quite thin 32 pound mm, this one's so nice though like, this one's only 22 and it feels thicker and it's more of like a bluey gray sort of color but i love that and there is matching trousers to this one if you're not a trouser girly there's a skirt this little workout section's cute i'm really surprised that primark haven't done stanley dupes yet but these little like shorts and bralette tops are so nice to say l to l i don't know what that means but they're nice nice quality and only nine pound for the set i actually really love these bags up here as well that khaki one is sick and it's such a nice size the knitwear section is not really giving like that's giving nand curtains this one's kind of cute this pink color is cute but i don't actually like the style of the actual jumper like if we're comparing all of this to the other viral primark jumpers then not it. These are kind of cute though. I might try one of these on. But I'd want like an XL so it's really slouchy. And they've got it in pink as well which is cute. You know when you can't tell if something's cool or ugly? Like I love the colour of this and the style. But I just don't know if I like the material of it. It's like a chenille sort of thing. Guys the summer stuff has started to make an appearance in January. Not the biggest selection but there's a little bit. I am picking up a little pair of these because they're literally a pound. And like I said I'm going away next month so. Just a little basic that I need. I like these too. Like with a bikini. I think I'm gonna grab these, they'd be so nice with a khaki bikini like this. I just don't like the bottom, so I think I'm gonna try and find a bikini somewhere else. I don't like how big they are at the back. Like, I don't want a thong, but they're just like full on briefs, and I don't really want those. Right, I'm in the jeans and cargo section again. A denim skirt that would look so sick on other people, but just not me. But there is these silver trousers from Retora's collection that are on sale. They're £20 instead of 30 but how nice are they? I do already have like three pairs of silver trousers so I don't need more. This sort of stuff reminds me of stuff that I'd wear when I first started going clubbing like when I was 17. Well, I shouldn't say 17 but 17. This pink suit is so cute. I love the colour of it. It's kind of like a dusty pink. And then again there's a score or matching trousers over there. I don't think I'm ever going to understand this trend. Like these were for school and school only. I don't understand how people are wearing them out now. I like, absolutely no hate if you're one of them people that do and you can pull it off. But I just don't. Can't get my head around that. They were school shoes to me. Primark have really up their jewelry game, listen. You can tell how heavy they are. And they're only 3 for three pairs. These rings are giving Boho Moon as well. I don't know how much they are, but it says $4. I did see Grace pick these up on her TikTok for like, get ready with me to clip your hair back. So I'm going to copy. They've also got like pink ones as well, but I think I'm going to get these ones. These are the headbands that I've got in my head for anyone that wonders. You can't really see it because I've got my headphones on, but just these little zigzaggy ones. I don't know how to pick up. I want to pick up another pack. And they've also got these. They're like headbands without going all the way around. So I think I'm gonna get those as well. I kind of wish it wasn't brown though, and I wish it was like clear, but we're gonna go with those. We're finally getting towards all the Valentine stuff and the pajamas. Imagine these for Galentines. So cute. These are my favourite pajamas in the whole entire world. They're from Primark. They're like the really soft ones. Not that there's any left, but they've got the matching dressing gowns. They're so cute. I only want them because there's a bear on them. And it reminds me of Keeks and Cobes. Oh. Do I get them, do or not? Three pound. I don't need any more socks, but they are so cute. So, in they go. We've got a whole mean girl section. I love these shorts so much, but they only come as the set and I wouldn't, I don't really want the tops, do you know what I mean? But there's some that say, that's so fetch and the quality of the shorts as well is so nice. They look really thick. There's also like a juicy couture vibe tracksuit. I'm a mouse, duh. A dressing gown. Baby pink in these sets, which is nice. I don't understand who would buy that and walk around with that, but you know. But yeah, I love these shorts, but I'm not going to buy the set just for the shorts. Do you know what I mean? And I'm really disappointed. Like, I really wanted the fluffy heart socks. Nowhere to be seen. I really wanted to see the heart hoodie. Nowhere to be seen. I've still got the one with chilies on. And there's Barbie. But there's no actual Valentine stuff. Like, am I too late? It's not even February yet. How am I too late? These are creepy, though. <laughs> Who's dressing up as a telly to be? What grown adult? is dressing up as a telly because that is creepy. I'm not usually a Disney pyjama kind of person, but these ones are actually really cute, especially these pink ones. And they've got Bambi ones, and then these Winnie the Pooh ones as well, which are really cute. All of the rest of this stuff gets a big fat no from me. That is so ugly. <laughs> and it's £20. Who's spending £20 on that? Right, I've come to the home section because I've given up on the clothes. And there's so many like bright spring colours out there, so many pinks and greens. I actually really like this vase, but as we all know, okay, it's this rib stuff, so I think if I bought it at home, 
he would smash it. <laughs> but it's £10. And this one's really cute as well. This would kind of match the kitchen. I don't know if it's a little bit dark, but how nice is that? And it's only £4.50. This is cool for Primark. I don't really like the colour of like this bit that is painted, but for Primark that's actually really sick. And it's only £4.50, what a bag. I feel like it'd be rude to not smell some candles. This one's cashmere. It doesn't really smell of anything. Amber woods. Why well, candles are normally where it's at as well? This one's vanilla and lavender, weird combo. It smells quite fresh. And then there's these bum candles. I feel like the bum trend has not been and gone, but it's kind of cool. But it doesn't smell of anything. This is kind of cute. Little peach. These look so expensive. They're only twenty pound each. And I'd love something like that on my bedside tables, but I'm gonna have to wait till our next house because our current bedside tables are so small. That they probably wouldn't even fit on. I've only got three things to try them. I want to quickly try them on. So I'm speaking really quiet because there's no one else in here. This is the pink jumper. I don't hate it, but I would prefer it to be a lot bigger, like a lot more oversized. And this is obviously the biggest they do, it's an XL. I don't think it's supposed to be oversized, but I'd want it quite like slouchy and off the shoulder. So I'm not even going to try the cream one on because it's going to look the same. Like it's cute, which is just not what I want. Now I'm going to get these though. They're just like a little basic flare. With pockets to go with a bikini on holiday. Can't really go wrong. They don't really look good with this jumper, but <laughs> I'm gonna get these. If you've been following me from like my Skims saga with the pink top, everyone said to get a nude coloured bra. So I might pick up this Skims one because it's like skin colour, so surely it shouldn't be see for it. So do I or do I just not waste my money trying to get that top to not be see for anymore? Shopping is done and I'm back in the car. I decided against the Skims bra because I didn't really want to spend another £38 on one. Um, and also, I went to Adenola because I wanted to get some like, olive green leggings, but they only had shorts. I'm like, I need the leggings, so I might order them online. But then after that, you know, we just like, get me out of here. Just let me go home. So, yeah, I'll give you a haul of all the stuff I got in Primark. I did pick up a couple of little bits at the end um, that I haven't showed you yet. So, I'm going to drive home now. So, it's going to take me 35 minutes to get home. That is so long. What time is it? It's 2 o'clock now. So, I don't know why everyone's out in traffic, but apparently they are. But I'm going to drive home now. And then I'll give you a little haul of all the little bits that I bought. Are we ready for probably the worst Primark haul you've ever seen in your life? Drink cakes, as she's always, wherever I am, she goes. I went in looking for the Valentine's stuff. Did I get any of it? No. I did get one thing that I did actually want to get, and the Valentine's heart socks. I'm going to put these on. Actually, I'm going to put one now. Two pairs for three fifty. What a bark. I didn't find these, though, until right at the end. Oh, no. Right by the till. But they're so cute, so I'm going to pop these on. Sada, gorge. Just a bit of a slag for fluffy socks, I'm not gonna lie. They're just the best things ever, especially when it's this cold. There we go. I'm not gonna lie, the rest of it is kind of crap. Primark in Birmingham, it's the biggest Primark in the world, but it's probably the worst. I've said this so many times. Some packing cubes. <laughs> this is such a random haul. I'm going on holiday next month, and my suitcase is always just literally shit thrown in it. An organised queen, get some packing cubes. So I'm put like bikinis in there shorts dresses like that kind of thing so they were three four five pound next thing i did get these for my holiday just as like a bikini cover up i'm on the beach or by the pool these like khaki trousers these were 10 pound i got them in a small they're like a crinkly flare just to go over a bikini to be honest like i need to get a khaki green bikini they did have one in primark but the primark pants they're so like wide i'm just like nah next thing i picked up was these headbands i loved the color of this one I'm going to try them on and see if they suit me because they are like quite wide. These were £3.50 for two, which is kind of expensive. Next, I got some more headbands. These are like the elasticated ones that I've been wearing that you've all been asking me where they're from. They're from Primark and you get three for £2.50. They're literally just little stretchy rings. They go like all the way around your head, but then I found these ones which give the same effect, but they're just like normal headbands. These were £2.50 for two. I kind of wish there was a clear one and a black one rather than the brown, but you know what? I'll still wear them. These little clips are so cute. I'm going to use these for like my get ready with me. You know, I like to clip my bits of hair back like this. £4.50, but you do get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten little mini clips. I did have pink as well, but I just prefer the blue ones. These earrings, these are giving expensive. Listen to the sound of these. You can tell how heavy they are. We all know Primark earrings are usually quite like light and nothing in. £3.50 for three pairs, but they are all like different sizes and shapes. And I thought they were so nice. It's such a classic as well. You can't go wrong with a god hoop. Didn't need these, but anything with bears on, I'm suddenly obsessed because it just reminds me of Coves and Keeks. So I got these five pack of bear socks for £3. These ones are cute though, look. They've got little bears on. Oh, I will wear them, but I didn't need them. Look, these sandals. These are like Birkenstock dupes, kind of. They're like £8. But I just thought again for holiday, just to chuck on. I just need you some like daytime sandals. And I don't have any black ones, so these are perfect. They had a few other colours as well. They had like a beige. And it was so nice. I was tempted to get it, but I thought I'll just get the black for now. And I can go back if I want to. Size up in these, I got them in a six. But 
I think they're cute. I just grabbed a pair of the one pound flip flops for by the pool at the beach, whatever, you know, just to chuck on and go. And then the last thing that I got from Primark was this cotton pad dispenser because I've just got mine in my drawers at the minute and they're a lot hard to get in and out the drawer because they're so big. So I thought I'd grab one of these, two pound, put my cotton pads in, put it on my desk. Just, again, didn't need it, but. That is everything that I got from Primark.